Hi guys! So for those of you who have been watching my videos, you know that I recently received a Garmin Edge 130 Plus as a gift. And so in order to take advantage of the device's features, I had to invest in some other auxiliary devices. Specifically, a heart rate monitor, a speed sensor, and a cadence sensor. I would normally buy the name brand accessories for my gadgets, but for this instance, I decided to do otherwise. Primarily because the Garmin branded accessories are four to five times more expensive versus the alternative brands. And so what we have here are products from a company called Magin. And yes, I said Magin, not Vagin. Uh, Vagin hang like slave of wizard. Huh. So this brand was recommended to me by a good friend who said that the price is very good and that the performance is nothing really to complain about. So that's what's most important. It works. So here is the Magin H64 heart rate monitor which I got for only 945 pesos. So roughly that's just $19. Now these two are the same model. These are the Magin S3 speed and cadence sensors. So they can act as both a speed or a cadence sensor depending on what you set it to. So I got both for only 1,132 pesos. So that's for these two already both. Let's take a look at the Magin H64 heart rate monitor first. Now this is a very, very straightforward unboxing. Nothing much is inside the box. So we have the chest strap over here. And we have the Heart rate monitor itself. And it does come with a battery, so that's nothing to worry about. To open the battery, you'll see a small um, tab over here, which you just have to push aside just like that. There we go. Easy. To put it back on, just do the same movement, only in reverse. So just screw it back on. Yeah. So this attaches to the chest strap. It comes with some paperwork as well, but this is quite useless if you're non-Chinese. So, aside from the pictures, you won't really understand anything from this. Now for the S3 Plus cadence and speed sensors, it's also quite a straightforward unboxing. And yes, it also comes with the Chinese paperwork. Has the sensor itself. And also comes with these elastic bands. A big one and a small one, which are used to attach the sensor to your cramp arm or to your hub. And interestingly, it comes with this piece of rubber which will place underneath the sensor so it doesn't scratch your cramp arm or your hub. Pretty neat. Now in order to switch between the speed and cadence sensors mode, it's quite 
straightforward. You just have to remove the battery and put it back in. There we go. So when the LED light is flashing red, it means it's in the cadence mode. Now if we remove the battery and place it back in, it should switch to speed mode. There we go. The LED light is flashing green now. So it's as easy as that. As mentioned, I will be using these machine accessories with the Garmin Edge 130 Plus. So I've already tried connecting them with the device and it was hassle free. So it connects via Ant Plus and Bluetooth and that's quite convenient. So again, thanks for watching and that is the unboxing of the Magin S3 Plus speed and cadence sensors in the Magin H64 heart rate monitor. Thank you.